and first tonight venomous blue dragons along the Texas coast. So this might sound like something <laughs> like a fish tail, but we're talking about these are real. Yeah, and they kind of give you the creeps. Mm -hmm. <laughs> these are small sea creatures. They look like a slug and they've got wings, but boy, they can pack a seriously painful sting. Fox 26's Matthew Sudorf is live in Galveston tonight. Matthew, have you actually seen one of these creepy blue dragons? <laughs> Not yet. We've been walking the beach all day, kind of digging through the sand, looking for these blue dragons. So far, we haven't seen any, but they are just a little bit further down the coast. An unusual sea creature now washing on shore Texas beaches. If you get stung by one of these, uh, we say, you know, take it easy. Venomous sea slugs known as blue dragons discovered this week between North Padre and Mustang Islands. The rare sci-fi looking creature, only about one or two inches big, has a painful sting. And that's why we ask people to, you know, if they get stung badly, they need to call the doctor. Uh, maybe even go to the hospital. I wouldn't know what to think. I, it definitely, I wouldn't feel like it was uh, dangerous. Beto Inahosa searching the sand in Galveston for treasure. Here, Cap. This bottle cap, the only thing blue so far. Have you seen anything unusual? No, I have not. No. No diamonds, no gold rings, nothing like that either. No blue dragons. No blue dragons, of course not. <laughs> Many beachgoers confused. What does a blue dragon look like? A dragon that's blue. We had to show them what blue dragons even are. I don't know, I have never seen one. Venomous blue dragons feed on Portuguese man of war. Recent onshore winds pushing these bizarre creatures closer to people. Well, right now, uh, Mustang Island and North Padre Island is where we're getting the reports over this last week. Uh, but the way the ocean currents work and the way the winds blow things on shore, it's, it's possible for them to show up in Galveston. So, so far, no reports of any blue dragons here in the Galveston area, but that can all change with the wind. Reporting live in Galveston tonight, Matthew Seedorf, Fox 26 News.